Today, I'm gonna be fantasy booking the Royal Rumble. Live. What is going on guys, Brutalite back in the video. Today we are going to be writing the script for the Royal Rumble match. Yes, of course, the Royal Rumble is coming up here soon. On the, oh, it's in the horizon. The Royal Rumble is on the 28th of January here in 2023. And I am so excited for this Royal Rumble because it's the first Royal Rumble where the head of creative is not Vince McMahon. It's Triple H. Triple H is the head of creative right now and he is the head of writing this Royal Rumble. Who wins? Who gets eliminated? Who comes out? Who returns? I'm so excited. And I thought to myself, I'm like, you know what? What if I fantasy booked my own Royal Rumble for WWE? So in this notebook right here, I have a bunch of different things that are going to happen throughout the Royal Rumble. Who's going to enter at number one all the way to 30? And we're going to jump right into it. Before we get started, let me know down in the comments down below right now. Right now, scroll down, scroll, 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 down in the comments down below, who's winning the Royal Rumble in your opinion? There's a lot of options, but let me know your opinions. Who's winning the Royal Rumble? In the comments right now. And smash the like as well. Entering the Royal Rumble at number one, it is Austin Theory. Austin Theory enters at number one, and number two following him is Rey Mysterio. They brawl, they fight, nobody gets eliminated. Number three is Damian Priest. Damian Priest comes out, and this Damian Priest is a, an aggressive Damian Priest. Say he lost the tag team title match to the Usos, he's pissed off, so he's entering this Royal Rumble at number three. He comes out, he beats down Theory, he beats down Rey Mysterio. Mysterio. And then Ricochet comes out at number four. Ricochet runs down, gets a hot start, does a little springboard, springboard here, there. Nobody's been eliminated yet. Number five, Master Gable. Shoes! Dun, 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 dun. Chad Gable comes out, not Otis. I uh, decided Chad Gable um, to come out at number five. I feel like, you know, he's the more like solid wrestler of the two. So I decided on Chad Gable to come out. Chad Gable comes out and Chad Gable just goes to town. He eliminates Ricochet. Chad Gable's on a hot streak, taking down people, but then Damian Priest takes him down. Damian Priest is the dominant force in the Rumble right now. Theory can't even hold up to Damian Priest, or they've tried to eliminate Rey Mysterio multiple times. It didn't work out. Rey's holding on to the ropes. Number six, here comes Bobby Lashley, somebody to contend with. Damian Priest steps to his face they start brawling and they, it, it continues number seven our first return of the night it is Edge Edge comes out returns from his little hiatus attending to Beth Phoenix I'd assume and he comes out and he targets Damian Priest because of course the judgment day making his life hell when they destroyed Beth Phoenix his wife so Edge comes out he eliminates Damian Priest I want to mark that down Edge eliminates Damian Priest, screws over the Judgment Day a little bit, not allowing them to may possibly win the Royal Rumble. So Edge was at number seven. Number eight, here comes Johnny Gargano. Johnny Gargano runs down. He starts maybe teaming up with Edge a little bit to take out Theory, to take out Lashley. Um, so Johnny Gargano's currently in the ring. Uh, Dexter Loomis comes out right after Johnny Gargano at number nine. Here comes Dexter Loomis. He runs down. Him and uh, Johnny Gargano are standing next to each other, looking like they're about to take out Theory, and then Dexter Loomis turns on Gargano, throws Gargano over the top rope. Gargano gets eliminated, just like that, by his former friend, uh, Dexter Loomis. Number 10, here comes The Miz! I decided to put all these guys in their former storyline that they had, Gargano, Loomis, and Miz, all in order, so then they, we could just, like, get a storyline a little bit getting told in the Royal Rumble. So here comes The Miz. Miz runs down, looks at Gargano. He passes him because Gargano just got eliminated. Miz jumps in the ring, has a little face off with Dexter Loomis, and... Boom! Bobby Lashley from behind. He takes out Loomis, and then Miz and Lashley start beating down on Loomis, and Miz picks up Loomis, eliminates Dexter Loomis. So the Miz got his little revenge on Dexter Loomis there again. Here comes number 11, Kofi Kingston. Kofi Kingston runs down, enters the ring. The match continues. 12, Shelton Benjamin. Same thing, enters, match continues. Nobody's eliminated. 13, here comes... Braun Strowman. Braun Strowman enters the match, and this is where we clean house. First, Austin Theory, number one, is eliminated by Braun Strowman. Five, Chad Gable had a good showing, but he's eliminated by Braun Strowman. 
Shelton Benjamin, who basically just entered the Royal Rumble, eliminated by Braun Strowman. There's Braun with three eliminations right off the bat. Number 14, here comes Mustafa Ali. Mustafa Ali enters the match, does a couple springboards, some high-flying maneuvers. He, you know, he targets Rey Mysterio. He, he targets Edge, you know, trying to maybe squander the opportunity of Edge in his return. But Mustafa Ali is currently in the ring. Number 15, we are halfway through the Royal Rumble. Baron Corbin. Baron Corbin enters with JBL. He sends him down to the ring. Go get him, Tiger, you know what I'm saying? Uh... Baron Corbin enters the match, eliminates Mustafa Ali. Corbin's currently in the ring. Dolph Ziggler runs down. Dolph Ziggler at number 17 here. Dolph Ziggler entering at, at 16. I'm sorry. Dolph Ziggler entering at 16, and he's running down, and he's going to stay in the Royal Rumble for a long, long time. Ziggler's in the match. Here comes Xavier Woods, the first member of the New Day. Xavier Woods at number 17. Xavier Woods runs down, and he eliminates The Miz. Number 18 is Sheamus. Sheamus, the powerhouse. He runs down. He's entering the match. And Sheamus goes right after Rey Mysterio. Not particularly, I don't know why he would, but he goes right after Rey Mysterio. And Sheamus eliminates the number two spot, which was Rey Mysterio. So our number one and two, Austin Theory and Rey Mysterio, are gone. Sheamus is in the ring. Number 19, big, big return. Number 19 will be Cody Rhodes. Cody Rhodes enters at number 19, and he goes ham. Cody Rhodes targets Braun Strowman, who's currently on his feet, dominating this Royal Rumble, dominating the superstars in the ring. Cody Rhodes steps right up to him after his insane entrance, people going freaking nuts, and he freaking misses a blow or something like that. Crossroads eliminates Braun Strowman. Cody Rhodes gets attacked by Ziggler, gets attacked by Corbin, but Cody Rhodes evades. He eliminates Baron Corbin. He eliminates, um, he eliminates Xavier Woods as well. Cody Rhodes is on an absolute roll. Number 20 is Seth freaking Rollins. Cody Rhodes got everybody down in the ring. He is on his feet, hyping up the crowd. Let's go. And here comes the visionary, the revolutionary Seth freaking Rollins. Rollins! Here comes Seth Rollins at number 20. He runs down. Well, no, he doesn't run down. He walks down. Methodical laugh on the face of Seth. Steps to Cody, and they just, they brawl. They brawl. Everybody's down. It's only Seth and Cody. They're brawling. They're basically having a one-on-one -on -one match in the center of the ring. It's great. Fans are going nuts. Boom! They fight each other that much that Seth eventually knocks down Cody Rhodes. Number 21, Drew McIntyre. Drew McIntyre runs down. Drew McIntyre enters the match, and Drew McIntyre eliminates Kofi Kingston. Drew McIntyre eliminated Kofi Kingston after Kofi Kingston did, had some sort of miraculous save in the Royal Rumble, but he always have a has a really good save, but he could never stay in. Kofi Kingston gets eliminated by Drew McIntyre. Here comes Elias. Elias enters, and Elias comes out. He gets eliminated right away by Drew McIntyre. So Drew McIntyre has two eliminations there, eliminates Elias right away. And then number, tw number 23, here comes Big E! Big E will make his return in the Royal Rumble at possibly number 23. Big E runs down. He goes ham. He eliminates Sheamus. Big E's on a roll. He eliminates Edge. He eliminates Edge. Edge has been in this Royal Rumble for a long freaking time, and Big E just eliminated Edge. Fans are mixed opinions on that. They're, they're, some people are not the biggest fan of it that he was able to eliminate him. Currently in the match still, we have Bobby Lashley. We have Dolph Ziggler, who's still in the match, Cody Rhodes, Seth Rollins, Drew McIntyre, and Big E. Number 24, here comes Solo Sokoa, the enforcer of the bloodline, looking to enforce the victory in the Royal Rumble, so then maybe the Tribal Chief doesn't have to face anybody at WrestleMania. So here comes Solo Sokoa. He runs down, he brawls, he does a little face-off with Big E. Both guys similar in stature, so they're going to fight, they're going to brawl. That's going to be good. Uh, number 25, here comes some, um, uh, who, here comes Santos Escobar from Legado del Fantasma. He runs down, and uh, he, he does a little brawling here and there. Bobby Lashley from number 6 eliminates freaking Solo Sokoa. Solo Sokoa gets eliminated by Bobby Lashley, who entered at number six. Bobby Lashley is the earliest entry that is still in this match currently. Bobby Lashley's still in. Number 25 is Santos Escobar. Number 26, here comes Sami Zayn. He passes Solo Sokoa, and he tells Solo Sokoa, I got this, don't worry, as Solo Sokoa tries to get back in the ring. Here comes Sami Zayn. Sami Zayn runs down. He enters the match. And is he entering this match to take out Roman Reigns, or is he entering this match... I don't know. It, I, it, you know, the conspiracy with Sami Zayn. You never know. So Sami answers at number 26. The brawl continues. 27 is Bray Wyatt. 
All the wrestlers stop fighting in the ring. Here comes Bray Wyatt. Enters slowly. Dark light after he already beat LA Knight in the Lights Out match. He comes out looking to take the dub in this Royal Rumble match. Bray Wyatt eliminates Bobby Lashley. Bobby Lashley is gone from number six. He was beat down. He was bruised. He was battered. And he has no chance of coming back. Number 28 is Bobby Roode. Bobby Roode comes out. And he targets Dolph Ziggler. Dolph Ziggler, who is still in this match. Bobby Roode comes out because, of course, they're a former tag team. The Dirty Dogs. I hated that tag team. Uh, but he comes out and he targets Dolph Ziggler, hits that glorious DDT, and eliminates Dolph Ziggler. Bobby Roode eliminates Dolph Ziggler. We're getting rid of all of the early entries. They were all too beat down. They were all too bruised and battered. And... Bobby Roode just eliminated Dolph Ziggler. Number 29, here comes the beast incarnate, Brock Lesnar. Brock Lesnar comes out, takes out everybody, doesn't eliminate anybody, takes out everybody. Lesnar standing in the ring, right, waiting for number 30. Here comes number 30. It is Stone Cold Steve Austin. Stone Cold Steve Austin. Say what you want, I'm just trying to make this interesting. Stone Cold Steve Austin comes out, face-to-face -face confrontation with the beast incarnate. And he talks to him. He's like, you really think you're going to take me out in this, in this Royal Rumble? No. Nah. So Stone Cold comes out. He brawls. He um, targets Lesnar. And now everybody's in the ring. Everybody, all the entries have entered. Um, and Steve Austin somehow eliminates Lesnar. Steve Austin takes out Lesnar. Robert Roode is taken out by Steve Austin. Or Bobby Roode, I should say. Bray Wyatt gets beaten down by Steve Austin. Sami Zayn steps up to Steve Austin, takes him out with a blue thunderbomb. Steve Austin's down. Sami Zayn gets targeted by Santos Escobar, but eventually eliminates Santos Escobar. Big E and Sami Zayn have a little face-to-face -face confrontation. Big E, unfortunately, gets taken out by Seth Rollins as he was focusing attention on Sami Zayn. Seth Rollins takes out Cody Rhodes. And Cody Rhodes is not eliminated yet, but he hits the curb stomp on him, and he takes out Sami Zayn. Seth Rollins is on top. Bray Wyatt steps to, uh, to Seth Rollins, and Seth Rollins is like, nah, this ain't happening. Takes out Bray Wyatt, eliminates Bray Wyatt. Fans aren't too happy about that elimination. Current members in the ring, we have Cody Rhodes, Seth Rollins, Drew McIntyre, Sami Zayn, and Steve Austin. Drew McIntyre, after... He just took out Cody Rhodes. Claymore to Seth Rollins. Seth Rollins gets eliminated. Not even by Cody Rhodes. Seth Rollins gets eliminated by Drew McIntyre. Drew McIntyre took out Seth Rollins. And then here comes Sami Zayn. He targets Drew McIntyre. Doesn't work out. Cody Rhodes comes from behind. Eliminates Sami Zayn. Sami Zayn gets eliminated. Final three. Cody Rhodes, Drew McIntyre, and Stone Cold Steve Austin. The first one to be eliminated is Steve Austin. Steve Austin is eliminated by Drew McIntyre. And then the final two are Drew McIntyre and Seth, uh, and no, and uh, Cody Rhodes. And then the eventual winner is Cody Rhodes. That's who I have winning this Royal Rumble. He hits the um, crossroads on Drew McIntyre, not once, not twice, but three times to eliminate Drew McIntyre. Cody Rhodes goes on to WrestleMania to face Roman Reigns for the WWE Championship, and he beats Roman Reigns for that championship. And then, later in the show, after Roman Reigns beats Kevin Owens, The Rock comes out and challenges Roman Reigns for the Universal Championship at WrestleMania. Roman has two matches at WrestleMania, loses one of the belts to Cody, and beats The Rock. That has been my fantasy booking video of the 30-man Royal Rumble men's match. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Yes, it was a little out there, but I tried to make it a little interesting for you guys. Let me know again who you guys think is going to win down in the comments down below and also fantasy book a little let me know who's gonna eliminate who who's gonna come out who's gonna return in the comments down below just make the comment section interesting i love reading through the comments guys i always read them so feel free to leave a comment down below smash like in the video subscribe to the live and i'll see you guys next time Brett, out.